It's the decision the Democratic Party has anxiously waited for. Who will replace Senator John Walsh in the Senate race? The state central committee made their decision loud and clear. Amanda Curtis will be the new candidate running in the U.S. Senate race. The delegates only nominated two candidates in the convention, Dirk Adams and Amanda Curtis. I drove all this way to be a part of history, but also to place my vote for Amanda Curtis. My preference is Dirk Adams. After a discussion on the nominees, the delegates grabbed their pens, got settled, and cast their vote. All 128 ballots were collected, and then came the moment of truth. Amanda Curtis had 82 votes. Dirk Adams has 46 votes. This has been certified by three people and observers. And just like that, Amanda Curtis became the new Democrat candidate for the U.S. Senate race. My immediate thought is that I'm excited to get to work. Um, this is a, a quick campaign that Montanans have been hungry for, and I just can't wait. My favorite part of of running for the legislature in Butte was going door to door and visiting with my neighbors and I cannot wait to have the chance to do that again all across Montana. The Secretary of State accepted Curtis's appointment and collected the filing fee immediately after the convention adjourned. Everything has been signed, everything's official, I've accepted it and it's good to go. Curtis tells me that she's excited to get right to work on her campaign and meet eyeball to eyeball with Montanans throughout the state. And it's needless to say the Democrat Party is pleased with the results and they're ready to hit the ground running to get back into the U.S. Senate race. In Helena, Amanda Rowley, ABC Fox, Montana News.